Good morning, Siman Tov, Mazal Tov, specifically to Tzachi and Mor, Zlika, and the whole family that's with us, Mazal Tov. In a few moments, we will start the Brit. We're going to mention a very special halakha this morning, something that we do very often, and we have to know why we do it and how the proper way to do it. And this is the halakha of answering Baruch Hu Baruch Shemo. The truth is that there is an absolute obligation when a person hears someone say a beracha to answer Amen. Baruch Hu Baruch Shemo is not an absolute halakha, it is rather a minhai. And therefore, there are a di there's a difference between answering Amen and Baruch Hu Baruch Shemo. The source why we answer Baruch Hu Baruch Shemo when we hear someone make a beracha is quoted from the Pasuk, Ki Shem Adonai Ekra Habu Godel Lelohenu. When you hear God's name called out, that's when we also call out as well. So when someone says Baruch Ata Hashem, the words we say are Baruch Hu U Baruch Shemo. Sometimes it comes out as Baruch Shemo. Comes out really fast. But at least we have to understand the words that we're saying. Baruch Hu, let he be blessed. U Baruch Shemo, and let his name be blessed. Whenever we hear God's name, <coughs> similar when we hear about a when we hear about tzaddik that passed, we say zecher tzaddik libracha. If we're going to do that for a tzaddik, obviously for Hakadosh Baruch Hu, that's more God Himself. So that's why we say Baruch Hu u Baruch Shemo, and it is a minhag. Coming to the repetition of the Amida, also by those blessings that the Hazan makes on our behalf by repeating the Amida. We should also answer not only Amen at the end of the Bracha, but also Baruch Hu U Baruch Shemo. Now what that means, as the Chazan, as the one leading, when we say Baruch Ata Hashem, he has to pause, allow everyone to answer Baruch Hu U Baruch Shemo, and then finish off Hakela Kadosh, and, vice, and, and so on and so forth for each one. But if you have a Chazan that didn't know this Halakha, and he's going very fast, he says, Baruch Atah Hashem Akela Kadosh. He doesn't stop. We are not supposed to, as a congregation, answer Baruch Hu U Baruch Shemo, because while we answer Baruch Hu U Baruch Shemo, he is going to say Akela Kadosh, and then we won't be able to answer Amen because we would not have heard it. So again, it's important to answer Baruch Hu U Baruch Shemo all the time, whenever we're able to. The only exception is if you. If the one who's reciting the blessing is going too fast, you won't be able to hear the blessing, and then you're going to not be able to answer Amen. There's one more scenario where it is a dispute amongst the, halach amongst the halach halachic authorities if we answer Baruch Hu Baruch Shemo, and that is when someone is making a blessing on your behalf. For example, Kiddush. Kiddush, the father of the house, gets up and he does Sabri Maranan, Nechaim, Baruch Ata Hashem. Now, right there. Right before he's going to go do and Elokinu Melech Haram Borete Yagefen. Are we supposed to, as other people participating in the meal, answer Baruch Hu Baruch Shemo? It is a big machloket, to say the least. It is something which the halachic authorities take a grand dispute on. Hamavadya Yosef is of the opinion that answering Baruch Hu Baruch Shemo over there, when you need to be acquitted from that blessing, is considered an interruption and you're not supposed to. The Moroccan Minhag, for the vast majority, is that it's not considered an interruption, it's likened to answering Amen, and therefore, as Moroccans, we do answer Baruch Hu Baruch Shemo. Again, everyone's able to at least choose their own minhag, but just so we know, it is up for debate. Some say it would be an interruption and we should not answer, by any bracha that someone's doing on your behalf, like Hamotzi, like Kiddush, like any other bracha that someone's doing for you and that you are being acquitted. And the Moroccan Minhag is yes to answer Baruch Hu Hu Baruch Shemo. May HaKadosh Baruch Hu answer all our brachot. May He be blessed, may His name be blessed, and may we have again a Simantov Mazatov to the Zika family. Zaku Baruch.